I'm back home from work. I miss filming for starters, so there's that. Two, I just had the best trip, the best week off of work. It doesn't really feel, don't look at the mess behind me, oh my God. It's so bad. <laughs> my place is trashed. My hair needs to be fixed. I just got back from a turn and I'm starting off a new vlog with you guys. I have some exciting things to share. I have a trip tomorrow and I feel guilty <laughs> because I had the opportunity to give you guys like a cooler vlog. A Costa Rica trip popped into open time, that's what we call it. Last night, it's kind of like a little pot of trips that they need flight attendants for and I could have swapped into that trip instead of what I did today. I just did a Fort Myers turn today, but I wouldn't have been able to be home tonight. I would be in Costa Rica for 24 hours, which would have been incredible, and I should have done that. I should have done it, but there was a part of me that just really wanted to be home, and I was very slow going to swap into that trip, and I did it so slow, because I was thinking about it, that it was gone by the time someone picked it up really fast. But I'm happy that I get to be home. I needed to be home because I have packages here that are perishable anyway, so I, don't have to have a neighbor come get it. Anyway, blah, blah, blah. Let me clean myself up and then I'll be able to start sharing with you guys. Oh, not to mention, I went skiing last week. That is dead skin from peeling. And I was so self-conscious at work today. You no longer have to wear masks, as most of you know, because I have, I'm like peeling all over my face. And it looks to me like snot but it's not, it's just dead skin. So I've been trying to like take the obvious pieces away. It's so gross, I know, but it's healed for the most part. I'm just hoping it goes away soon. Now let me get myself cleaned up. I needed to give that disclaimer. I'm a little bit cleaned up. Really, I just like rinsed off my body and changed clothes. I had to like just sit and chill on my couch for a while and just kind of scroll my phone, but that in itself is kind of like dangerous. I feel like it makes me extra tired when I do that. I'm using my Quinten C Plasma, putting it in some water. This stuff is super hydrating. I need to update my Amazon shop and put this on there. But this is what I've been using for hydration lately, one of the things. I'm trying out a lot of different products for hydration lately, but I can talk more about that later. You can probably hear my washer going. It's very loud. Okay, I got not one, but two packages from Daily Harvest, and I'm gonna share with you guys what was in those packages. I am beyond excited about this. I have enough food now to last me like a month. So let me get to it and show y'all what's in here. I literally have two big boxes. Like this one's massive of Daily Harvest food. Daily Harvest sent me all this food y'all and I'm in shock because it's beyond generous. They're doing an Earth Day promotion. So that's what this first box is about. Let me share quickly what's in here. So everything is like greens and obviously plant-based. It's daily harvest, but this one is like green-centric for Earth Day. So they gave me leek and fonio grits. They gave me the matcha murasaki bites. These are really good. They gave me a banana and greens smoothie. The mint cacao smoothie, which is my absolute favorite. This one is so good. They gave me their little matcha pods. Very excited about that. This is the broccoli and cheese harvest bowl. This is the gigante bean and plus savoy cabbage harvest bowl. I have harvest bowls for days. And this I'm really excited about because I have not yet tried their flatbreads. So this is the artichoke and spinach flatbread. That's what I've been wanting to try the most. Of course my fridge is going crazy now. I just can't keep it quiet in this apartment. And then the last thing in the Earth Day box is a Harvest Baked Gigante Bean. Gigante? Am I saying that correctly? And artichoke oleo. Harvest Baked. These are so big. Like, look at that. That's enough food for like three days for me. Like as a meal prep, I can, I can get a lot out of that. You just pop it in the oven. So that is that stuff. You guys, I May is a big month for me. And I'll talk more about it later. But things are changing. Spring and summer is on its way. Vera is making a few changes, like I've talked about before, but I'm gonna go in more depth soon. And these boxes, they couldn't have come at a better time because they're really gonna help. And I'm so excited to share with y'all my upcoming journey. Now this box, 
I wonder why they sent it in such a big box. I mean, it is a good amount of stuff, but there's more food in the small box than there is in the big box, whatever. Daily Harvest reached out to me and they asked if I would like to review a new food item for them and try it out, talk about it on my channel. And I said, absolutely, when I read about what it was. So this just came out yesterday. It'll be maybe like a week or so by the time you guys watch this. But Daily Harvest just came out with crumbles. So these are plant-based protein crumbles. Each serving has 13 grams of protein in it and you can sprinkle it on, oh, by the way, it's like made with natural, real ingredients. This is the French lentil and leek and then this one is walnut and thyme. I wanna make little like tacos with them or sprinkle it in my soup. I do a lot of soups, like bone broth soups, and I like to sprinkle stuff in there, so this would be really good in that. By the way, you can eat plant-based food. You don't have to be vegan. I just wanna make that abundantly clear because I feel like a lot of people are under the impression that when I talk about eating plant-based foods that I don't eat meat or that if they eat meat, why would they eat plant-based food? I don't know, whatever. I'm going to put this in my bone broth. That's something I am very excited about, just for extra plant benefits in there and a little bit of extra protein. But I am also very excited to eat it with little tacos. I'm gonna get some butter lettuce and put it in there. So what they did was Daily Harvest was kind enough to send me some food items that I can put the protein sprinkles on. So they gave me this portobello pesto flatbread. They gave me this sweet potato wild rice hash. This is a harvest bowl. Lentil and tomato bolognese harvest bowl. And then they gave me butternut squash chimichurri harvest bowl. One last thing, tomato basil flatbread. So now I have like a million flatbreads and I had really been wanting to try them for a while. I have to figure out how in the world I am going to fit this stuff in my freezer, but I'm kind of glad that it doesn't fit in my freezer because I need to eat it and I'm going to start eating it this weekend. Lots of changes coming, not big changes, but you know, going in the right direction. Kind of centering back to wellness and travel and that's it. No more extra fluff for a little bit, maybe a little, but not really. All right guys, I'm exhausted. The past three nights in a row, I've gotten, I, I was came in on a red eye one night, that was two nights ago, and then that following night, no sleep. I think maybe four hours of sleep. And then last night, I think I got six hours of sleep. So I, I, I'm playing catch up at this point, and tonight I'm gonna try to go to bed at 8 p.m., 5.37 now. <laughs> So tired and work this turn I have a Houston turn tomorrow but I don't want to bore you guys so I feel like I'm super spacey right now so I want to talk to y'all when I have more energy and I can share interesting things instead of ramble and say um and look off into the distance a lot okay <laughs> guys it is bedtime it is loud in here because i have the ac blasting just did my skincare i'm still using naked and thriving i really like that i have the oils now because i can just contour my face with gua sha and the oils um so far really enjoying naked thriving i talked about them more in my last video i'll leave a link for them down below their serums and their face oils the eye cream is really good anyway did that i'm in my new pajama set you guys, I am so obsessed with these pajamas. So I got these off of Revolve. Revolve has really, really good pajama options. And it's one of those things like I you want, but sometimes like it seems silly because I have t-shirts and old clothes that I sleep in. It seems silly to buy like a nice pair of pajamas, but this pajama set, it just makes me happy. It, it covers everything. It's like long pants, but it's really thin, thin, lightweight material. So it keeps me cool, but it helps me feel covered at the same time, which I like. And that will be good for layovers. I want these in like every color. I'm so obsessed. I have the white and I want to get them in pink. They're from Revolve and I can leave a link for this specific set down below. I was able to treat myself, so it's nice. Anyway, little things, little luxuries like that, just kind of like boost your mood, little moments of joy, if you know what I mean. And I made my tea, my bedtime tea. So this is the Saqqara Detox Tea. 
and in it I want to get back in the habit of drinking detox tea before I go to bed in it I put mood juice from organic Olivia this stuff is kind of just like a warm hug at nighttime I find it helps me get cozier in the bed and ready to fall asleep easier um, it has a lot of plants in it that help with de-stressing like holy basil um, st. John's wort lemon balm they're all just really good for oh there goes the air really good for calming you down calming your nervous system lowering your cortisol all of that great stuff I'll leave a link for that below as well organic Olivia I swear by every product she has I'm just gonna drink this I'm gonna read my book and I will talk to you guys in the morning good morning guys my uber is like three minutes away so I'm gonna hop in my Uber, but quickly, I just want to bring, I'm gonna bring a couple things. I'm going to bring my Athletic Greens cup because I have the little separate Athletic Green powders in my bag, these little guys. So these are really nice because you can just use the water on the plane, like our bottled water, and shake it up. And I have a little green drink. I am bringing two Peak Matcha packets, my Stevia, my Electric Whisk, and some walnut milk for work. The other things I have in there, I have blueberries with the, some seeds, like some of the phasey pumpkin seeds and flax seeds. And I have my coconut smoothie I'm gonna pour over that. I have boiled eggs, I have bone broth. That's really it, honestly. I think that should be enough milk. Might be too much milk, honestly. I'll throw another matcha packet in just in case. My Uber is here, so I'm going downstairs. I will see you guys on the road and in the air. Hello guys, my heat is going so it's super loud in here but I wanted to share before I finished, I'm taking my longevity mushrooms. This stuff is so good, it tastes like chocolate. It's so loud, I wish it wasn't so loud but also I'm taking, this one is like probably the most important to me, my liposomal magnesium L3 and 8. I'm gonna take that gonna watch some YouTube gonna kick back I was planning on making I have like this chicken dish well I have chicken and I was gonna do the harvest bake from daily harvest but instead I decided to do the portobello pesto flatbread maybe put a little bit of hot sauce my oven is preheating right now it looks really good I'm not gonna lie all right friends there she is it looks so good this is my first time trying their flatbread my camera might fall so I'm gonna film myself trying it. I put the yellow bird sriracha on it because I just love yellow bird sriracha. That is delicious. I think that's gonna be like a regular thing for me now from Daily Harvest is the flatbreads. It was really easy. I put it in the oven, gluten-free crust. It's a broccoli crust. It's honestly really good. I'm gonna get an Olipop, kick back, watch YouTube, hang out, and just chill because I need it. Good morning guys, I am about to go for a walk. It is, I think it's like 8.40 or maybe almost nine. I haven't washed my hair in so long, so I have like a ton of hair coming out as I comb it. But I'm about to put on some sunscreen and I'm going to put a mask in my hair. I just have this one that I need to finish off. This is the, I honestly don't even think they sell it anymore. It's the Sage Wellness Hair Repair. I feel like last time I tried to find it, I couldn't gonna run it through and then put it in a little low bun okay for sunscreen I'm just going to finish off what I have of this SPF 32 cocoa kind sunscreen there's like hardly anything left in here that's it drinking my lemon water with sea minerals it's very sunny out today and I think I forgot to tell you guys maybe I did maybe I didn't I think I did tell you guys on the Chicago blog I don't remember that I got new hokas I got the all white ones. I had been needing these so bad. I have the on cloud ones and they're like, okay. I'm just gonna use those in the gym. But when I go for my long walks at home and maybe even I'll bring these on my layovers, I'm just gonna wear my Hoka's because they're the most comfortable. Nothing really compares to them. They're the most comfortable. And I feel like I can walk miles and miles and miles in them and be fine. My place is a mess. 
like I have so much cleaning to do it's insane that is going to be the theme of today is clean house all right guys oh my goodness really quickly I'm going to take a couple supplements I'm going to take the mushroom supplement from symbiotica it tastes so good that stuff is so good and then I'm gonna take my vitamin b12 12 pumps and then I'm going to take my adrenal tonic I'm actually focusing a little bit more right now on helping out my nervous system and my adrenals. And then, this is like a whole system right now. I am going to take coconut water, pour it in this glass. I'm going to take a scoop of my athletic greens powder. Everyone's out running and walking. It's so nice out today. And then, a squeeze of lemon all together. Going to take my little whisk, whisk it all together. I need energy right now. So today is day one of no caffeine for a month. It's something I decided to do a few days ago. My friend Suzanne is doing it with me and I feel it today. I definitely want, I definitely want some form of caffeine because I'm dragging, I feel really sleepy and I slept 10 hours last night because it was the first night in a while where I could just sleep through the night. So I slept about nine to 10 hours and maybe nine actually i don't think i slept 10 hours and i'm just dragging i want to pick me up so bad but i'm just taking my vitamins getting in greens and taking care of myself i'm going to make a smoothie probably a daily harvest smoothie but if you guys want to try out daily harvest i highly recommend it i think it's the more like cost friendly meal delivery program and it's the most ethical because you can just it's frozen so you don't have to worry about anything going bad or eating eating it within a certain time but if you do want to try it and you haven't tried it before make sure you use my code because you get a pretty decent discount you get up to 40 dollars off i believe but i'll have the link and the code for that down below y'all i'm gonna end off the vlog here so I can focus on what I need to do today and I actually need to edit this current vlog and post it. But go ahead and follow me on Instagram. Sometimes when I don't vlog trips, I post about them a lot on my Instagram. So go follow me over there. Make sure you're subscribed if you're not already. Please say hello in the comments and give this video a thumbs up because it really supports my channel. Just hit the little like button down below. Anyway, I will see you guys in my next vlog. Bye.